Oh yeah, I'm G and I'm having my hair cut at uh, Gentleman and Rose. Sweet. So, for G, you're uh, going as short as a two, aren't you? Yeah, where's all yeah. these? Winter time. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. So shall I do like a, a grade two to up to the table? Yep. Up to the temple, even. Table. Table. Up to the table. Temple. So two up to the temple, and then just gradually get longer from there. Yeah. And then you're having this all back, but you want a fair bit of length off the um, off the fringe here. Yeah. But you want still high quiff. Yeah. And it all pumping backwards still. He's a high quiff. <laughs> Let's do this. So, anyways, what I've done is I've just sectioned away the top. So all I have to focus on is the sides. We're going to start off with a grade two and blend our way up. So wall icons, two guard, and I'm just going to just take it to the temple. As I hit the temple, I flick out. So this is, my, this is going to be my shortest point. So I'm never going to go shorter than this. So now I've got a grade two to the temple, flicking out, and I've gone to my matador comb. Comb in and angle out. Following the baseline. So as where it dips down, going at an angle, and go straight down. Angling my comb out. So it gradually gets longer. So I hold it in flat, angle out, cut across. Doing it from left to right, just making sure I just clear the bulk. And if I see slight lines, I go in there up to down. Keeping that spine of the comb against the head and angling it out. This is just making it longer from that uh, two. Now from where I left off with the um, matador comb, all that weight left, I'm just spraying it with water and combing it down. And I'm going to be doing a scissor over comb. Sweet. So this is scissor over comb. I'm just doing some point cutting to blend in the line. But yeah, I've gone from two guards to the temple, flick. And then from this uh, distance here, I've done the matador comb. And now scissor over comb. And all that is blending it out. Sweet. So that's from two guard to here, matador comb to here, scissor over comb to here. Let's crack on with the top, that's why. Sweet. So now I've combed the sides backwards to match the, uh, the top. You can see that there's just a slight like weight line where it's disconnected. So what I'm gonna do, two for the comb, from the temple, go straight across to the other side, to the other side of the crown. There we are, so temple, the other side of the crown. What you're then gonna do, fine see for the comb, and pull down to match. So we've got the side here. This is where the, this is where the side is. Let me recomb that. Shortest point. Cut across. Came down. Shortest point. And doing this just connects the sides to the top. So what I just did there, as we just missed it from Josh's amazing joke, I came down, and I followed, I followed this guideline all the way across. There it is again. There it is again. There it is again. All straight line. Now I'm going the other direction. I think if the guy was screaming and saying, I'd say which one of yours, mate. Yeah. Shortest point, longest point. Yeah. Calm down. Sweet. So now I've connected both of these sides. I've only got this in the center now to connect. So what I'm going to do is do like a uh, diamond shape, put it into a point. 
combs away because this is, this is the only thing that's not connected now. Let's just separate this. Now I'm going to do angles because we're having a rockabilly style, so he wants it quite quiff, quite high, and then going back. So all this is now slicked. This is what we need to connect with quite a high pump. So take it in smaller triangles. And I'm going to judge, I'm going to take off about, about a knuckle's worth. Point cut it. And then grab it. Twist it. What twisting does to it is just makes it a little bit more random. And it blends in that little bit nicer. Not that you can see it, I'm going to dry that off now and just see how it sits. AJ. G. JG. JG. GIJ. GIJ. How's that lamb team? I've taken off a fair bit, but I didn't want to take it too short so I won't be able to sit its way back. Yeah, that's good. Sound right. Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> Sharpen up around the edges and put some wax in there. Yeah, we all had our heads shaved once, Dave. Yeah, I had my head shaved. Yeah, one of our friends was going through. A terrible time. <laughs> Just going to nick it a little bit short at the bottom of the neck if you don't mind. One guard, open. Flick. Yeah, if it was that good, Dave, you want to cut it yourself, mate. Yeah, your haircut's good, but I'm just going to cut it again. Just in case. Could have wait, waited until he left or you got home. Yeah. Disrespecting. Yeah, whatever, Dave. Do it then. So I've got some pomade on my hands, and I'm just going to scrub it into those roots. <laughs> what the, the pomade? <laughs> it's got pomade on my hands. Is that a 0.5? 0.5 pomade? Yeah, yeah. yeah, it is, mate. And if you open the lever a little bit, you can make it a 0.75. <laughs> Tommy, if you're listening. Tommy, if you're watching this right now. Yeah, and, and his brother's called Dave. Sweet, sweet G? Nice, lovely. All right, happy? Of course G's happy. Beardbrain is a premium men's grooming company with products not only for your beard, but also your hair and body. Do yourself a favor and head over to beardbrand.com and take care of yourself. Or 
You can stick around and watch a few more of our awesome videos.